Welcome back to Sports Scene. Thanks for sticking with us. A couple from Uganda are preparing to spend their first Valentine's Day together as man and wife. But theirs isn't an ordinary love story. They came together over a mutual love for cricket. Here's CGTN's Leon Sinyanga with their love story. The love story between these two started on the cricket pitch. Martin Ondeko and Lelia Namaganda have both played the game at club and national team levels. And it was their shared love of cricket that drew them together. We used to go for competitions in Lugogo. Of course I would see him, but I would say that small man. <laughs> but we never talked. For Martin, Lelia was the perfect coach. You know, some of these things, you just can't explain them, how, how, how they go to happen. You just know you're in a cricket field. Uh, you look at someone and you like them, and they're a bit, a bit unique from uh, other people that you've met. And then you just hit it off. And like they always say, the rest is history. They got engaged in 2015, tied the knot in 2020, and now have a child together. The husband and wife pair are still involved in cricket. Lelia plays in the Women's National League. Martin is the chief executive officer of the Uganda Cricket Association. They have not let the game get into the way of a healthy relationship. The fact that you can have cricket arguments means you have something in common that you can actually, uh, you can actually talk about. And I think it's very good for a marriage when you, you, you have a, a common interest. Since I'm a cricketer, I think I would rather, I try to keep it to the minimum because I don't want to bring, I don't want him to have his work life integrated into the home life. This cricket mad couple are looking forward to a long innings together. It will be Martin and Lelia's first Valentine's Day celebration since getting married last October. They plan on spending the day not on the cricket oval, but at home. And that may just be their perfect way of spending a little joy on February the 14th. Leon Sanyange CGTN, Kampala, Uganda.